Hi Adiba, good afternoon. A very quick uh, video on the, the Cougar. Uh, I did put a, a Sol sticker on it so none of my colleagues tried to do any test drives or anything like that. So yeah, uh, to start off in the front, uh, again, um, uh, you do have the LED uh, headlights and they are auto high beam and low beam. Fog lights at the bottom, uh, no marks or scratches on, on the panel. Uh, alloy wheels, again, the two-tone, that's one of the reasons we say the alloy uh, package itself is uh, good to have so you've, you've got the silver bit and you've got the black bit as well with red calipers of course uh, looking at it here uh, no marks or scratches the mirror is as clean as you can get um, so there we go you do have keyless entry so when you walk to the car the car can open up or lock uh, for you and again at the edge no marks here uh, same for the rear I've opened the window because it's boiling in there uh, again looking at the back wheel uh, no scratches or bits and pieces or um, um, any marks at all because this is quite a clean and tidy car. Uh, looking at the, the bumper side, you do have uh, the rear camera, uh, I don't know if you can see, and, and the sensors obviously, and the ST line logos and badges and so on. Uh, okay, that's not a scratch, that's just a dead bug. Sorry, it scared me there for a second. <laughs> so, yeah, looking at it here. Uh, on this side again same principle no marks or scratches no alloy scuff at all red calipers um, and again the fuel flap now the fuel flap is unlocked by pressing a button inside the car which I'll show you when you're here uh, and, and again looking at it no marks or scratches same for the alloy wheels no marks or scratches with the red calipers uh, this one here you just push it in to open it that's where you plug it in if you wish to charge it um, and obviously to release it you press this that's the timer a lot of people get cheaper rate at night time so if you plug it in at five o'clock in the evening when you go home but you don't want the charges to start then you want the charge to start at 12 o'clock midnight you can set a timer you can use your phone or use the computer on, on the car to set the set the time uh, and again, looking at it here, uh, th these these white dots are actually just some dust particle from from the from the um, the road because it was facing the road. So no marks or scratches. And looking at it from, from here, I'll do the inside really quickly. So once you're in the car, electronically adjusted with lumbar support, um, auto headlights. That's what the fuel. Um, opener is and that's the boot uh, the power tailgate so once here uh, you do you do have different buttons here but to start the car is behind the indicator that button there um, uh, well, let's get rid of this noise looking at it over there will give you all the information on there how much electric and uh, how much fuel you have is on the bottom as well along with the speed now the heads-up display I've mentioned earlier would have sat over here now again it's still the same as what you can see over there very clearly right hand side that controls that screen left hand side that's the adaptive cruise control lane centering assist traffic sign recognition as you can see that's the 30 miles an hour there um, navigation uh, you know you can see what the car's doing the the battery charge and so on and charge preference climate control heated seats heated steering wheel um, and obviously that's just the USB bit with Apple CarPlay. You can obviously put it into different different drive modes. Uh, that noise is because I've um, put it into reverse and the door's open so nothing to worry about. The automatic parking, um, auto hold and all of that. Um, and then you've got the, uh, the panel roof which opens by the way so you, you can press this button and it will open up. Um, which I'll demonstrate to you when you're here. Uh, all the seats again immaculate as you can be sliding armrest and then if I get out of the car um, you do have power power tailgate on here so you can do the foot operation we put your foot underneath it the boot opens up on its own uh, and again if you look at the boot it's as clean as it could be uh, the, these seats recline and slide forward and backward automatically uh, that's where the 12 volt battery goes. You don't get a, a spare wheel obviously, but you get the inflation kit with it So that's a very short video explaining the the um, the operations of the um, Of the the Cougar and I hope this helps. I'll explain more uh, Operations of it uh, when you are here. Oh lastly the door is protectors. Those are the black plastic trim that sits on the edge um, but when you close the when you close the door, they go and 
nicely just hide. So that's something we do. So I'll send this to you now.